We have five artists and ten thousand dollars. You will each have eight hours to make the best art possible. I'm pairing each one of you with a subscriber, and the subscriber wins whatever piece you make. So if you have a thousand dollar bills in that sculpture, that thousand dollars goes to the subscriber you're paired up with. Anybody in the mood for some bread? I love bread. Your eight hours begins now. One quick rule, I don't want to get in trouble, so you may see people gluing their dollar bills, painting their dollar bills, or cutting it up, but we're not going to do that today. I believe destroying dollar bills is illegal. So I've decided that I'm going to create a bunch of triangle units and create art by sticking them together somehow. Still don't know exactly what I'm going to do, though. I already know what I'm going to do. I'm going to make a skateboard. I have to poop really bad, so that might take up like an hour of my time. Jess, do you have a plan yet? Okay, I wanted to make something very detailed. So I'm gonna make a Jordan 1 out of money. Ben, do you have any ideas on what you're gonna do yet? Nope, but I made some stairs. Hey, right, Michelle, it looks like you're already getting started. So what's your plan? I'm making a skateboard. Okay. I'm going to be making a bouquet of flowers. And I feel like all the petals will take up a lot of money. So hopefully if I win, my subscriber will win a lot of money. First person to make a t-shirt out of a dollar bill wins something. It needs to look exactly like this. Look at Zach. Now it's a collar. No, just... That does not look like this. The sleeve oh. upside down. I, I think wait, Michelle might have got it. Oh, All right, good job, Michelle. Oh. <laughs> Michelle got the t-shirt. I, I just was finishing it. She even has a little tie at the front. Wow. All right, Michelle. At any point in the competition, you can take thirty dollars from anyone. Whoa! I love that. Okay, wait, bill. Ben. What are you doing? I'm making a giant heart out of small hearts now. You've been at this for over an hour. Ben, come on, be a little bit more creative, please. I'll make a dragon ben, out okay. of hearts. <laughs> Now you're gonna be mashed up with your subscribers. Felix used to be in the OG videos. Since you're subscribed, you're technically a subscriber and you get to choose one of the artists to pair up with. I want Ben! Oh. Thanks, Daddy. We're in the middle of a craft challenge and we're yes. making art out of money. Whatever I make and if I win, you get that amount of money. I have faith in you, Jake. Thank you, Jake. Yeah. Dude, I'm doing it for you. That's what I like to hear. Guys, I'm gonna give you three minutes to make a money airplane. Your goal for this is to build something that will fly as far as possible. One minute left. Three, two, one. Time's up. Everyone, come with me. So whoever flies their airplane the furthest gets an advantage. Whoever gets the shortest distance gets a punishment. <laughs> Whoa! I would have went farther if that wasn't there. Holy! Oh. Ah. Ben, what is this? Oh. Oh, this is not good. That is not fair. This is great. That is not fair. Is so ready to hear what you want? Grab someone and have them help you for 30 minutes. <laughs> Jazz, Ben, and Michelle, you each have 50 push ups. <laughs> Are you <laughs> kidding me? This is a roll of nickels. First person to open it up and dump it out with something. Sorry. Yeah. Oh! No. Everyone that just opened it, give your nickels to Jazz. These coins, you can do whatever you want with. You can add it to your piece, you can keep it. You get to decide. How many dollars do you think that is? Why are you here now, Michelle? I'm trying to see if I should take Mackenzie's mouse. I'll take Mackenzie's like, mouse head and then take the rest of things. Is she allowed to do that? She is. If you want to let Mackenzie win, be my guest. Hey, Jake, I'll miss you. I actually was working pretty fast and then Michelle just took my entire piece. I probably won't have a completed piece by the end. I made a really cool check for my shoe. It says, in God we trust across it. Exactly how many pennies are in this jar? I'll give you a grand. 550 
Four. Five hundred and eighty-three. Five hundred forty-four. Five hundred forty-two. Five twenty-seven. The final count: five hundred forty. Five. Ah! Michelle, you were one off. Dang it! For being one off, I'll, I'll give you two hundred bucks. To give <laughs> that was good. Wow! You guys have three minutes left. What? The I was being stupid and holding my art like this, but I realized in order to finish, I can just flip it upside down and have it walk like this on my feet. I am all done with my mouse princess. Princess slash ballerina. Five, four, three, two, one. All right, time's up. So Mackenzie, what am I looking at here? This is a mouse ballerina princess. I do see the mouse design and, and I like how the skirt looks. It looks, it looks pretty creepy. It looks nice. Thank you. Good job. All right, Jake, I know your art got destroyed. What is this thing? It, originally, I was going for a centipede type of thing, but I realized that I didn't have enough time. It kind of reminds so. me of a mantis shroom. Yeah, you did a really nice drop with the legs. These were supposed to be spines, but then I turned it upside down and realized I could just make them as legs. I made a skateboard, but I made one that actually works. It has wheels. Wait, what? So when you roll it, the wheels move. Oh, that's kind of cool. I don't even think it looks that impressive like this. It looks more impressive when you go like that. I also want to incorporate the Kenzie now. All right, Ben, tell me about it. Well, this is my very majestic creature. It's an alien hammerhead shark sea horse dragon. All right, Felix, come over here real quick. Felix, I want to know your honest opinion. Are you happy with the piece of work that Ben put out? I'm super happy. Creative piece? I, I actually don't think it turned out too bad. Jess, not gonna lie, at first, I was pretty concerned about your piece, but I think you really pulled through at the end. Tell me what your process was for this. Okay, this is <clears throat> the Jordan 1. So I put one on the toe box. I just try to really utilize the details of the ones. This is probably one of your better pieces. Good job, Jess. We're gonna play sudden death rounds. Two people are gonna go head to head, and one subscriber will decide your fates. I have five quarters. Two of them have eagles on the back. <laughs> Who has the eagle? Uh, <laughs> I sent both over to Nico and I said, which do you like better? And the person that's getting eliminated. <laughs> ben! <laughs> we got feelings now. Kenzie, choose one. Uh, I Who has the okay. eagle? Oh, oh, Dig against Jazz! I asked Namo from the home of the queen and the person getting eliminated, Jake! Oh my god! Michelle, why don't you choose first? Who has the eagle? Oh, Michelle, you're automatically in the final! Yeah! Mackenzie against Jazz. And keep in mind, the people that are judging right now are only judging their art because they're subscribed, so hit that subscribe button right now and you might be judging their artwork soon. And the person moving on to the finals, Mackenzie! Alright, I asked Tristan which one he liked better, functional skateboard or dress-up mouse. For the winner, Mackenzie, tell Michelle to tell you that you won! Yeah! <laughs> if you want to let Mackenzie win, be my guest. All the money you used in that piece will be going to your subscriber. Thank you, Joe, for believing in me and picking me to be your partner. I hope you like it and you get all this money. Today we are customizing Steve Aoki's house. What's up guys, I'm Steve Aoki. Zach came all the way out here because he's gonna paint this room. Super excited about it because I love his art. It's a little house tour. Wow. wow, there's so much art in this house. Wow. This is a crazy Wow, view. this is so nice. Yeah, you're gonna have to jump in here. Zach, yeah, that's you. That's all you. Michelle, are you gonna jump in? I'm okay up Yo, here. It's not the craziest thing I've ever done. Wow. Holy crap! Oh, I didn't know this moved. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, bro, I leaned on this and then this started moving out. <laughs> What's down here? This is like where I sleep. Oh, wow. Whoa. Whoa. So it's a huge collection. Steve, which one's your favorite? Definitely the big boys. <laughs> this room's so soft. Look at the walls. 
Oh, this is when you can jump in right now, for sure. Oh, I thought that was a person. <laughs> yeah, I thought there was someone sitting there. Yeah, it's my bro. Did you have a lot of say in like the design and stuff? Yeah. I hope you enjoyed the tour. Watch out, he bites. <laughs> I was thinking of the idea of combining the world of card, like sports cards that I love with your art, which I love. <laughs> Thank you. And then mixing in anime culture that I love. The, the room is the AOP's card house. If we can do both walls in the, the ceiling too. Uh, the, the ceiling is going to be a little bit tricky. Brighter the better. Steve just ran us down on the design he wants and it is very, very big. This entire room he wants covered. Here's the plan for it. So we're doing pastel yellows for the entire room. We have a pastel blue with pastel pink crack and it's gonna be one of our biggest projects. It's gonna be insane. <laughs> I don't even know where to start. I think we're just gonna start sketching it in. Okay. Ooh. What's up all you cool cats and kittens? Oh my god. <laughs> I'm with our boy Parker right here. We got a shop because we got to paint Steve Aoki's house today. Five of these I would say. So we're here at the color wall trying to figure out a bunch of Pokemon colors and other colors that we need. I think we found the Charizard orange right here. So we had to get a, another cart because we have a lot more supplies than last time. <laughs> Thank you. Let's get to work. Michelle, I'm gonna be climbing up the ladder. Oh, good luck. I'll hold it still for you. If this ladder breaks and falls, oh, I love you guys. Hello from up here. <laughs> Hello from down here. Doing the cracks in the ceiling now. It's very difficult. <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna fall. Right now, I'm gonna paint a Charizard, and Viv is gonna help me mix some paint. I'm ready. And Michelle is busy taping and looking at TikToks. Uh-oh. We're gonna grab one of these ruler things and just stick it in the paint. I'm painting the wall today, but before I paint the wall, I have to tape yeah. it up. We got everything taped up. Now we gotta pour it in the yellow. Stir. That looks good. Good job, Michelle. Thank you. <laughs> Pretty. Yeah. Oh, that's so pretty. How's it going over here, Joey? Getting pretty yellow up in my corner. Over I wanted here. you to paint the wall, not yourself, sir. <laughs> There's been an. Well, just pour the rest in there. So we're still going hard. We're doing great. I'm tired. Tired? You just got here. First day almost done, but we're wow. killing it. This is the best day of my life. I'm up in the ceiling and look at my hand. But I've got a lot more done now on Sailor Moon. Bye. It kind of looks like a children's room right now, so we gotta put in some bold colors. Hey Parker, how's it going? Just You're customized like my shorts. <laughs> That's a lot of mustard, Zach. Me and Viv decided we're gonna basically play Twister while we're painting. Oh, man. Right hand, pink. Left foot, left ladder. Ah! Sorry. It's getting real intense in here. Good job, everybody. Good job, guys. Proud of you guys. On to tomorrow. Let's get it. We're a couple hours into day two. Almost done with this big Charizard painting. We also put a Mewtwo up here, and then I just finished a cute little Bulbisaurus Rex. Yeah, that's Steve yeah. as a bear <laughs> walk character. How cute. Fire alarm just went off because we were using the heat gun next to the smoke detector. It was loud. Michelle looks hungry oh. as usual. Oh yeah, I'm waiting for my food. Viv pulled this ladder back and there was a ton of paint on top of here. And the paint went like... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Michelle! Just knocked over all the paint! Uh oh. Oh my goodness, what's that, Viv? Oh, it looks no. like you have an earring. <laughs> the food is here. It's not the cinnamon one. This one's good. Yes! 
Yo, this looks unbelievable. Oh my god, that car? I literally just finished it right before oh we walked in here. I'm oh, show a very easy task of outlining the letters. <laughs> I need a paper towel. It's okay. Okay. I thought I was a perfect artist. It happens to everybody. It has to be on yellow too. We did all this in just one and a half days. I think we're gonna come very, very early tomorrow morning. We're all exhausted. Bye. Whoa! Look at this room, Mom. You guys are incredible. It's 10 p.m. and we're almost done. My feet are very tired, but we've made a lot of progress. And right now, I'm working on the cracks. What's up? Hello, guys. <laughs> Everyone's on a ladder. Except for Michelle and Joey. I've been on this ladder for quite a while. It's pretty scary. I've also been painting. I'm not sure if I should be vlogging, but I think I did a pretty great job. I did a lot of yellow. I've been painting the ceiling for about three hours. We could not sleep. We're going crazy a little bit. Day three, and I'm almost done with the cracks. I really love... What? Why are you so salty? So last day, we got about 20 minutes of sleep. How about you? Yeah, three hours. Three hours? Whoa, how'd you fit that much in? <laughs> hey, can I have some of your sleep? <laughs> We're gonna put in the final touches. I'm so proud of us. We just finished painting the whole wall. Really happy with how it turned out. and six canvases. Whoever has the best painting after three hours will have a chance to win up to $5,000 for a subscriber. Yay! Any questions? I feel like there's more. Well, you guys are smart. <laughs> That's obviously not it. All right, who's going first? <laughs> All right, Jake. What? Whoa! <laughs> Jake, can you see anything? Yeah. I can't see <laughs> I think you guys have caught on. We are doing blindfold art. <laughs> <laughs> Artists, you have three hours. Time starts now. Hey, All right, Viv, what's the plan? So right now, I am measuring my canvas with my hands, finding the center, and that's gonna be the center for my butterflies. Okay, honestly, my energy just is lost a little bit. I feel like I can nap, it's so dark in here. Jake, what are you gonna paint? Something that I have yet to figure out. Mackenzie? Yes. So far up to this day, you've still won the most crafts challenges. Yes. <laughs> so, how do you think you're gonna win this one? I don't know. I've never tried to do anything blindfolded. The closest I've got was the drunk goggles challenge, but... I beat you in that one. Shut up. <laughs> Maybe I'll make space. I think I might try to do a self-portrait. What color do you think you have right now? So I'm picking up my colors right now and I can't see these but I feel like they're bright. I'm gonna go ahead and make a bunch of different like doodles and patterns and make it a big abstract piece. So, so they feel like bright colors. Yeah, and whatever comes to like my mind and heart is just gonna like go right on the canvas. Even though all of you have blindfolds on right now, some of you may not have it on the entire time. Wait, what? what? You may be able to win chances to take them off here and there. Keep that in mind. What are you doing, Jake? I'm going to grab a Red Bull. I remember I saw one earlier. What's going on? I've retrieved! That's pretty impressive. I remembered it. I, I had it. <laughs> Artists! If you win, you win $500. If you lose, you have to get drenched in paint. And if you win, don't forget, you can win up to $5,000 for a random subscriber. Yay! So that'll be fun. Yeah. Here's what we're gonna do right now. You're gonna play me in rock, paper, scissors. If you win, you get to take your blindfold off for two minutes. Okay. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. 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 Ah. Uh... You won. Yeah! <laughs> you have two minutes. Time starts now. Oh my gosh, what is this? I'm blind. Yeah! I have two minutes. I'm blind. Okay, I'm I still have two blind. minutes, so I can do this. Viv, how are you going to utilize this two minutes? I'm going to color in a lot of the butterflies. Jake, how are you going to utilize these two I'm minutes? I'm going to draw an outline of something and just leave it for the rest of the challenge. I realize that I do not have black for my outer space. I'm going to use gray and color the entire thing gray. I don't know. I. 
I don't really kind of like it. I'm just gonna. How come you know why you came clouds or something? I don't know what's. The other thing that's smart is right now you can choose your colors. All right, you guys have 30 seconds left. No! Five, four, three, two, one. Blindfold back on. First person to find scrunchie gets to take their blindfold off for 10 minutes. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Guys, it's around here, not back there. Where? Hey, hey, wait, 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 wait. This. Wait, where is it? Maybe. Wait, where did you say? Maybe. No. I said Jazz found scrunchie. What? She found it in a couple seconds. It was hidden underneath what? the giant iPhone. All right, everyone back to your seats. All right, Jazz, you can take your blindfold off for 10 minutes. Oh my gosh! This is so bargaining, so, otherwise you're going I'm four. I'm so happy. Wow, Good. Zach, you lied. You told me that that was orange. Did I? Wow. Jake is literally just drawing with a white marker right now. I really just don't oh. think you're telling the truth. Stop it! That was not <laughs> If I see someone else's paint marks on my all over my arms. That's not fair. That's not our fault. You ran into our markers. Jazlyn, time is up. Put your mask back on. Yes! <laughs> you pulled my eyeball! It's not raining! Viv, get back here. Guys, who took my painting? Guys, go back to painting. Oh. All right, oh. 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 oh my. Oh. Okay. In the next 20 seconds, if you're not working on your art piece, you have 500 push-ups. Five. Foot. Viv. Viv, it's here. Viv, it's here. It's here. It's here, Viv. Everyone, please make sure you're working on your own painting. Artists, here's what's gonna happen. Each one of you are gonna draw a self-portrait. The best two get an advantage. Go. You have three minutes. Oh, Jake, not bad. 30 seconds left. Five, four, three, two, one. Let's take a look. Okay. All right, Izzy. Very interesting. What on earth, Michelle? What? Mackenzie, not bad. <laughs> Jake's looks kind of funny. Viv, what on earth? <laughs> Two people get to take their blindfolds off for 10 minutes, so you get to take a look around. Izzy, go ahead and take it off. Mackenzie, go ahead and take it off. Oh Izzy, Mackenzie, come with me for a moment. All right, so you get two advantages. You don't need your blindfold for 10 minutes, and you get to choose one person to dump ice water on. Right here? Yeah, and, and they're gonna have no idea. All right, guys, go back to painting. Who is behind me? Izzy, Mackenzie, it's been 10 minutes. Blindfolds back on. Viv, how's your piece going so far? You have around 50 minutes left. I think it's going good. Apart from the water, I think it was not too much damage. Jake, how's your piece going? I don't know. What do you think? I think you may have one of the better ones just because the colors make sense. Mackenzie, what's your plan before we get to the end? I don't have a plan this time because I have no idea what I'm doing. So Michelle, what's your plan to win this thing? Win another challenge, be able to see and finish my painting because I think I'm almost done. The 10 minutes I got, I think really helped me out because I was able to kind of like make my piece a little more graphic. What's going on over here is a whole lot. I feel like I put a lot into my piece. The thing is, right now, none of them even know where they're at because they can't see, so it's a little bit hard to tell what to add and what not to add. So, here's what we're gonna do. All of you have 15 minutes without your blindfold. Go! Artists, 
blindfolds back on. And you have to be painting even when your blindfolds are on. So right now I'm painting the sides just because I know I can't mess it up too much if I just paint the sides the same color. I used my time really efficiently when I got 15 minutes and I just covered the edges of my piece. So right now I've decided I'm going to just paint the sides because I'm not sure where I'm painting in the center. Three, two, one. Artists, time is up. Everyone, get ready to present your art. All right, Jazz, why don't you tell me about your piece? So this is my breakout abstract piece. And I did like my name like popping out with a little like black dark space. I actually think it turned out pretty nice. So for my piece, I initially wanted to do like self portraits and then I did some flowers and then we got a little scribbled on it and it honestly turned into like a bit of an abstract mess. So I added THC and some kind of like Japanese elements. I think that was a really good idea, just scribbling when you had your blindfold on and when you took it off, turning that into something else. So I did a space painting. I got a couple of planets, I got two rocket ships and a bunch of astronauts. When I told you guys to put your blindfold back on, which parts were you working on? I was literally just doing this the entire time and this the entire time. All right, not a bad piece, Michelle. Mackenzie, what were you working on with your blindfold on? The grass. Was it to stall for time? Maybe. I'm still technically working on my art. That's cheating! I didn't feel like Mackenzie was pretty much stalling the whole time. I don't see a lot of blindfold art down. This whole thing, it what? The whole thing's <laughs> blindfold art. Interesting piece, Mackenzie. This is my super abstract piece. I was blindfolded for basically the entire challenge. I guess I just added a lot of colors and scribbles and patterns and I drew on my hand. Patterns you did actually came out kind of nice. So it started very abstract. I went through a lot of phases. And then when I opened my eyes, I saw the colors and then I decided to stick with them. It actually didn't turn out too bad. So what happened to the background? What did you use for that? Paint markers and some water. I really like the butterfly you made. I just wish you made the background black. We are going to begin eliminations now. Michelle, I'm probably gonna eliminate you first. <laughs> Next person out. You know what? Gabe. Put down your camera. Oh, come no. over here. Gabe, go ahead and eliminate the next person. You're gonna have to go with Ken's. Mackenzie, you're eliminated. I'm gonna have to go with Viv. <gasps> what? I didn't like the background. And now we're down to three. Gabe, do you think you know who the winner might be? Oh yeah, I know who I wanna pick. I'm gonna count down, and why don't you just go ahead and pick the winner. Everyone, drum roll please. You have officially won the blindfold art challenge. Good job. You don't get drenched in paint. Yay! So in a moment, we'll go win something for a subscriber. In the meantime, everyone, come with me. It's time to get painted. Oh, the losers paint. are in the tub. We have five giant buckets of paint. Three, two, one. Ah! 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 